we hear this a lot in hospice that somebody doesn't want their person to be told that they're going on to hospice or even that they're dying because they're afraid that they'll give up or they'll give up hope. In hospice, we like to say that we don't ask people to give up hope. We ask them to change what hope means. Hope that they can stay home with their family and friends at their bedside. Hope that they can be pain-free. Hope that they can avoid going to the ER or being hospitalized. As far as giving up, I think people misinterpret somebody resigning themselves to the inevitability of death as giving up. It's okay for someone to accept that they're going to die and not think of that as giving up. People need to be at peace with death in order to have a good death, to avoid things like terminal agitation and lingering for a long time. When it comes down to it, I think when families ask us not to say hospice or tell the person that they're dying, it isn't really as much about them being worried that that person's going to give up. It's about their own discomfort with having conversations with that person about the fact that they're dying. And that's really a bummer because those conversations are the secret sauce. Those conversations are going to hold some of the most meaningful words you will ever exchange. Those conversations allow for closure and goodbye.